हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम रक्षा वेलकम सी इन माय यूट्यूब चैनल दैट इज रक्षा इंग्लिश क्लब तो ऑलरेडी हम इंग्लिश हिंदी और ईवीएस की डेमो टीचिंग क्लास देख चुके हैं आज मैं आपके लिए लाई हूँ क्लास फाइव का एरिया एंड इट्स बाउंड्रीज सो ये मैथ्स का टॉपिक है और आज हम देखेंगे कि इसे हम क्लास में कैसे इंट्रोड्यूस करेंगे और कैसे इसका कॉन्सेप्ट क्लियर करेंगे सी गाइज आप भले ही अमाउंट कम रखें अपने एक्सप्लेनेशन का लेकिन उसमें क्वालिटी होना चाहिए इट मीन्स आपको क्वांटिटी पर फोकस नहीं करना है डेमो टीचिंग में आपको क्वालिटी पर जाना है एंड इट्स रियली वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट आप एग्जाम्पल्स क्या दे रहे हैं आप एक्सप्लेन कैसे कर रहे हैं एंड यू आर एबल टू क्लियर द डाउट ऑफ द चिल्ड्रेन और नॉट तो अभी तक अगर आपने वीडियो को लाइक नहीं किया है तो जल्दी से लाइक बटन को प्रेस कर दीजिए और चैनल को सब्सक्राइब कर दीजिए प्रेस द बेल आइकन फॉर द अपकमिंग वीडियो तो चलिए देख लेते हैं कि ये टॉपिक हमें कैसे क्लास में इंट्रोड्यूस करना है गुड मॉर्निंग चिल्ड्रेन डू यू नो टूडे आई वॉज हैविंग वन एक्टिविटी फॉर यू फॉर विच आई वॉज नीडिंग द पेजेस बट वैन आई वॉज स्टियरिंग द पेजेस आई टोर इट इन रॉन्ग साइज ये मिस्टेकनली द साइज आर रॉन्ग नाउ वॉट टू डू ओके we are going to use it but i am unable to measure these two pieces of paper anyone knows how to measure it okay i will tell you see i am having this piece of paper okay so first thing which i have to do is i will use one scale to measure its length and breadth okay i will use the scale to measure the length and breadth so who is going to help me to measure it okay take this scale take this paper and quickly measure it okay so anuj is measuring it anuj has measured the length of this paper is 7 cm and the breadth of this paper is 6 cm okay now do you know i am having one small square piece of paper also and i can calculate the area of this paper okay what is area see this is our classroom and the classroom is occupying a space okay and the space occupied by this classroom is called the area okay have you understood this so the space which is occupied by this rectangle is called its area have you understood what is the spelling of area a r e a area but how i am going to measure the area i am only having the length and breadth of this rectangle so for measuring the area of rectangle i am having this piece of paper do you want to see the magic i am going to do a magic and with this small piece of paper this is of square shape you can see i can measure the area of rectangle okay so this small piece of paper is of square shape okay and it is 1 cm square okay this is square is of 1 cm okay so if i am keeping my one square here okay this is my square of 1 cm how many squares i can arrange here because this rectangle is of 7 cm so one then one more two then three then four then five then six and seven so i can arrange the seven square pieces along the length of this rectangle okay then the same square pieces i want to arrange along the breadth of this rectangle so how many as it is 6 cm so obviously i can arrange the six square pieces around along its length okay so this is 1 2 3 4 5 6 i have arranged the six square pieces along its breadth also so in this way i have to cover the whole rectangle so who can tell me that how many square pieces i need all together how many square pieces i need okay you are going to calculate all no 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 i don't want you to waste the time okay i want you to do it quickly do it intelligently so what we can do here we are having 7 and here we are having 6 So if see the magic, how without counting, man is going to do seven into six. Who knows the table of seven? Okay, very nice. It's forty-two. So have you seen the magic? So total square pieces we need to cover the rectangle are forty-two. And do you know the magic? 
this is only the area of rectangle yes okay so area of rectangle is also 42 okay but we have to see the unit also what is unit what is the unit of the length here centimeter okay so when we are multiplying for the area of rectangle we are multiplying 7 centimeter and 6 centimeter 7 6 are 42 and centimeter centimeter becomes 2 centimeter so it is centimeter square so have you understood what is the area of rectangle it is same this is 42 centimeter square okay now I am going to give you one more piece of paper which is with me. You have to calculate the area of this piece of paper also. Okay. So see this is the piece of paper left with me and its length is 4 cm and the breadth is 2 cm. Okay. Come on. Quickly measure the area of rectangle. Okay. So have you seen guys how nicely, how interactively Doing the participation of the students also, I have called the student, I have done this problem on the board and we have come up with the solution and with the use of such good words, we can involve the children with us. Yes, you have to use very good words, you have to keep your facial expressions, you have to keep your modulation of voice, this is very important. If you have a steady constant voice, the children will be bored. Okay, and this is my 14 years of experience ki modulation of voice tremendously work karta hai bachcho ko apni taraf attract karne ke liye. Okay, isi chapter mein ek next topic bhi hai jis mein aapko dots ke upar designs banana hai aur usme concept hai 1 square centimeter ka. Okay, to chaliye jaldi se hum usko bhi dekh lete hai ki wo kya hai. Okay, have you solved it? Very nice. So, अभी मुझे कौन बताएगा कि घर में दिवाली पर रंगोली कौन-कौन बनाता है या रंगोली की डिजाइन किसको बनानी आती है ड्राइंग किसको बनानी आती है ओके okay, सभी को आता है ओके ड्राइंग रंगोली ओके वेरी नाइस सो टुडे मैम इज आल्सो गोइंग टू ड्रा वन रंगोली ओवर हियर वन डिजाइन ओवर हियर डू यू वांट मी टू ड्रा इट डू यू वांट टू सी ओके लेट्स सी ओके क्विकली आई एम गोइंग टू ड्रा इट फॉर यू एंड देन वी विल सी that how beautiful it is. Okay. Aap mujhe bataayenge ki ma'am ne isko kaisa draw kiya hai. Okay. Okay. Quickly we will see how ma'am is going to draw the drawing. Okay. How is it looking? Is it looking good? Okay. See. I have drawn it. Okay, what which shape you can see over here? Triangle. Okay, you can see the triangle. And do you know from which shape I have made this triangle? I have made this from a square. Do you want to know how? Okay, I am showing you. See, this is a square and when I am dividing it into two halves, it becomes two triangle to equal triangle okay so this one triangle and this one triangle all together becomes one centimeter square okay so it means if i'm counting two triangle it together becomes one centimeter square all of you tell me how many triangles we need to make one centimeter square two very nice so can you tell me how many triangles are here in this picture Okay, let's count with me. One, two, three and four. Very nice. But how many squares are in this picture? No square. No, it's there. Just I have told you that two triangles together makes one centimeter square. So, one, two. Two are making one. Then one, two. Again, one more. It means two squares. Okay, now you got it? Very nice. So, can you draw one design? Okay, you have to draw one design which is having um, how many? Five squares. Okay, you have to draw one design for me which is having five squares. Okay, so you draw one. I am also drawing one. Okay, let's see ki kis ka drawing jada better hai. Okay, quickly we have to do it. See, I am drawing. I am drawing. I am drawing. Yes. Okay, so how many times we need to draw it? We need five squares. And one square is equal to two triangles means 
5 into 2, we want 10 triangles. Okay? Okay. Quickly make it quickly. Let's see who is making first. Dekhte hai kaun jeetta hai. Do it fast. Yay! I have done it. See, I have made the 10 triangles which is making 5 squares and see my design. I am also unable to recognize what design it is. Okay, so have you learned how to make the designs using 1 cm square? But square draw nahi karna hai. Hame kya draw karna hai? Triangle draw karna hai. So it's very easy. So in this way, how many of you are going to draw the designs for me? Okay, so this is your homework that you have to make two designs. Okay, two designs you have to make. One design should have... 10 squares and another design should have 8 squares. Okay, so these designs you have to make for the homework and tomorrow I am going to see that who has made the beautiful design and then the same design we are going to make on the ground tomorrow. Okay, so have you liked today's class? Very nice. So guys you have seen in this way with the interaction with the practical examples we can make our class more interactive i hope you have liked this video agar aapko kisi aur topic par bhi koi demo class chahiye hai definitely you can comment below and don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel that is raksha's english club press the bell icon for the upcoming videos stay tuned with me thank you